Hey, I didn't think it would be like this. Like what? I mean, like this rich. This is too much for me. The Romeo and Juliet reboot Love Story was one of the 70s biggest blockbusters and a cinematic phenomenon. The story follows the romance between Oliver, a Harvard law student from a wealthy family, and Jennifer, a music student from a working class background. They fall in love and marry against his family's wishes, leading Oliver to be disowned. As they build their life together, they face struggles but remain committed to each other. Tragically, their relationship takes a heartbreaking turn when Jenny is diagnosed with a terminal illness. The profound simplicity and the emotional depth of the tragic romance resonated deeply with audiences worldwide. Eric Siegel, who wrote the story, was a professor of Greek literature. His strike into popular culture with Love Story marked him as a literary outcast among critics who dismissed his work as romantic drivel. It is not a great work of art. On the other hand, it has pleased an inordinately large number of people. Paramount Pictures, who acquired Love Story, believed its basic romance matched the spirit of the time, but were also concerned that it may be too basic for young audiences in America that started responding to advanced cinematic experiences like Bonnie and Clyde, The Graduate, or Easy Rider, who marked the birth of New Hollywood. Despite these concerns, Love Story achieved monumental success attributed to its adept blend of contemporary attitude and traditional melodrama. Jennifer's candidness was in contrast to the common behavior of on-screen young women of the time and challenged cinematic norms. The gap between Oliver and his conservative dad mirrored the generational divide that young America felt towards their parents in the late 60s. I seen it, but you enjoyed it, did you? I did indeed, yes. It made me sad, though. What? because I lost the woman I loved. The film's success introduced the new Romeo and Juliet to absolute stardom. Ryan O'Neill appeared in timeless classics like the legendary Paper Moon, along with his daughter Tatum, Stanley Kubrick's Barry Lyndon, and many more. Ellie McGraw was celebrated on the cover of Time magazine and moved on to further outstanding performances.